Simon, it just seemed that after the penalty, the the players just lost their focus. They they lost their shape. Uh, it wasn't how that City fielded the strongest possible team. And you had some of your better players on the bench. It was it a combination of the two that happened to that? Hello, good evening. <coughs> yeah, it's very bad night for us. It's a big defeat. It's hard to say anything positive when when the game finished like this. Uh, yeah, we started well, played well for half an hour until that first penalty, uh, first goal, and then uh, the crucial moments of apart from the penalty where where our reaction after the first goal. Okay, we had a great chance to equalize straight straight after that, but we we made the mistake that we start to chase them on a big pitch, uh, which is which is very difficult to do against them. If you give them, if you attack them on a big space, then then they find the space in between the lines or behind your defense, and that's exactly what what they've done in those ten ten minutes and. Until the end of the first half, and they scored two goals, and then of course it was it was game over. At the half time, we asked from the team to stay compact, to stay solid, not to concede more. You know, because it's not the same, of course. But unfortunately, we conceded a couple of more goals from the set pieces. As I said, it's hard to find anything positive from 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 when you. When you are defeated like 5 0 at home. Pep said the, the pitch and the stadium seem to make it easier for City than it has been for a lot of the season. Do you, do you see what yeah, I can understand it, of course. Yeah, it, it is a great pitch on a big stadium, you have space, but we gave them space as well, you know. Uh, but we played the, at the same stadium three, three days ago against Manchester United, also, let's say, I don't know, team of the same quality as we played tonight. And uh, we didn't give them too much space and we played even with the 10 men for the majority of the game. And But we didn't give them the holes between our lines or the space behind. Tonight we gave them, especially after the, especially after the first goal in those Ten crucial minutes that basically decided the game. Sorry. What's the thinking behind taking off Andy Carroll after 58 minutes? No, he's not injured. No, no, no. He, he's not injured. Just uh, he didn't feel well yesterday. He had a bit of flu, not the big one. Okay, but he had a. Beat the flu, so basically, after the three nil, we just wanted to save him, you know, to save him, not to get him in a position that he might get injured or whatever, because the game was, the game was over, and that's that's we were thinking about, about uh, keeping him in a good shape for uh, for the, the game against Palace. That's not nothing else. But he didn't train yesterday. He felt a bit of flu, but he was. Clear from the doctors, all well and everything. So we we started with him, but I felt it would be unnecessary to keep him um, till the end of the game when the result was anyway gone. It was four nil. Yeah, that's. Penalty decision. You know when you lose five nil. Okay, that penalty was not fourth goal or fifth goal. It was, some would say, the crucial point. I would say very, very important uh, point of the game because it was nil-nil. But it's very hard to talk about um, that thing when when you lose five-nil. I didn't see it again. From my point, it 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 looked a, bit, a little bit maybe soft, but. But no complaints about that, no, not at all. What was the thinking behind uh, not starting at Payet? Well, you know, we, we played 
this was our third game in six days. We wanted to put a very strong lineup, and we put we put a basically very very strong lineup out. And uh, also, Mark was ill for a couple of days, so this was the team that that we thought going to give is going to have a really good chance to 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 give them a game and to go through in the next round. And we had a plan because the game last 90 minutes to get something uh, quality and fresh from the bench as well. Unfortunately, it wasn't uh, good. But you know what? Now, now it's time for a team to show a character. Fortunately, we we have uh, we had a few of defeats like that. But let's say after Arsenal won, we we show character and quality and team spirit, and we went to Liverpool. And after that, three more games, we got 10 points after that hard defeat. Now is the time to do it again. All right. Thank you.